Hey guys, so I just finished my therapy session. Um, we're calling it like round two of adult life, maybe? I don't know, what do we think? Um, so I have round two of treatment goals and I thought I would share them with you all. So, I mean, every therapist or psychologist operates differently as far as like what they're required to do by their supervisor or what they like to do with patients. But um, in this case, we, we set um, therapy goals together um, which is pretty cool and like pretty fun. <laughs> so, and like he's quite good at writing. It's my new therapist again. So um, let's go through them. So the first one I said is I wanted to be able to strengthen my emotional self-regulation. And that's meaning like two things, like being able to, being able to stay like in tough conversations or in tough meetings um, when I'm feeling like emotionally overwhelmed, like how, do, how can we, um, neutralize these emotions so that my fight or flight does not kick in. Um, and then uh, the other facet of that one of strength and self-regulation, emotional self-regulation is being able to self-soothe, which is very similar to the other one, but um, being able to not, you know, kids rely on their parents to help them soothe. Um, but once you become older you have to start getting those skills yourself and then I don't feel mine are that developed um so I gotta do that and then the second goal I have is um strengthen interpersonal assertiveness and boundary setting skills which is like with other people so I find that people bring their energy into my space very often um and I absorb that very quickly. I think I have a blog post about being an empath and that's when you often absorb kind of people's energy and emotions as they bring them to you because you feel what they're saying and you're not able to separate yourself. That's me. So I need to be able to say how it's making me feel or if I don't want to know that information anymore or if I can't have this conversation right now, being able to say those things, that's assertiveness and boundary setting. And then the third goal, um, Actually, these are out of order. That was the third goal. This is the second, but whatever. Is, um, like, how to manage a workday with time management and prioritization and, and completing tasks. Um, because as I talked about a couple videos ago, um, I thought I might be a candidate for an ADHD diagnosis just given the way that I operate at work and at home. Um, so I would like to learn, even if it's not ADHD, it's just like not being, not being very organized um, and forgetting things a lot, different ways to be able to do all of those skills really well. Because it is a skill and you can learn it, I think. We're going to try it out um, and test it theory. But those are my three treatment goals. Um, I hope you all have a great week. I hope I have a great week too.